two, we have team coverage tracking the rough weather this morning. That's right. Our Anthony Sabella is live in Norfolk taking a look at some areas that might see some rough spots. Anthony, it looks like you're seeing some damage behind you. Is that a fallen tree? Yeah, that's right. You know, it's not a big tree, but it's big enough that it's crossing uh, the street here completely across Bedford Street, which is just off Hampton Boulevard in the Larchmont section of the city. So just an example of some of the damage we're seeing this morning. You can see we got the orange traffic cone here in front of the tree, which means crews have already spotted it, probably planning to take care of it sometime today. But I, it just goes to show that the wind is what the real issue is today. As you wake up, we've seen a little bit of rain come down since we've been on the road this morning. Morning, but really the wind is is what is affecting us today. So make sure you probably want to have both hands on the wheel, for example, and just really be paying attention to any ponding on the roads as well as you take off to head to work today, if that's what your plan is. But, you know, it always it is interesting to see what kind of damage this wind can cause. I mean, this tree was snapped right at the trunk over there. This wasn't like a big branch that fell down. This was the entire tree. So it'll be interesting to see driving around this morning if there will be any other damage that we're going to be able to find that's like this. We're going to be keeping an eye on the roads really all morning long, kind of driving around the cities and seeing what we can find. So be sure to check in throughout the morning here on News 3. We'll be sure to let you know what we find out. We're live here in Norfolk, Anthony Sabella, News 3. Anthony, thank you. We want to show you a few pictures sent in to us from Dominion Energy. They worked yesterday restoring power throughout Hampton Roads because of this nasty weather. And now you can see just how much progress has been done. We want to give you an update as we uh, take a look at the outage map. In just the past 30 minutes, Dominion sites reported nearly 2,400 homes and businesses without power in our area. And most of the customers uh, over near Mona Avenue have power in uh, that is in the Ocean View section of Norfolk, but the lights are out still for a few of them. We've also learned there are about 1,100 customers in Virginia Beach that are waking up in the dark. Uh, some were around the Regent University area. We do know Dominion Energy has crews working overnight to get the lights back on for everyone.